Tracy, those union members have just arrived, and as you said, they're starting to picket. You can see them behind me, and uh, they are here because they've been working on an expired contract since June 30th. They failed to come to an agreement with the school district, and so now they're meeting once again. They've had at least a dozen meetings with the school district since the contract expired in June, and they say that the biggest issue right now is that fact that the superintendent is subcontracting out, uh, they say, jobs to uh, teachers in the district. So union members here are asking for a 3% increase in wages over the next three years. They're also requesting an increase in short-term disability coverage, as well as an increase in sick day accrual. And again, the biggest issue union members say is, again, the fact that uh, the superintendent is allowing teachers within the district to take over some of those bus driving hours that they say is taking money right out of their pockets. They offered the wage increase that we wanted in return for that subcontracting language, and we said no because we're sticking up for the bus drivers, and the bus drivers need to have the right to their work and not have anybody else doing it. The meeting will be getting underway in just a few minutes, and bus drivers here say they're hoping to come to some conclusion in the next couple of weeks because to carry on with this would ultimately end up costing the school district more than what they're asking for in wage increases. Live in Biddeford, Courtney Sturgeon, WMTW News 8.